Hey guys, uh, welcome to your love reading for Capricorn. This is going to be for the first half of your uh, March from the 1st to the 15th. You could apply this to your Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. Um, so we're going to take a look and see what's going on with you guys in love and the person that you are connecting with. And then we will take a look at your person to see what their true feelings and intentions are towards you. And then we'll finish off the read with the outcome and advice and what else you guys need to know, look out for, work on, apply this to your own unique situation. You could switch to roles if you want. Keep in mind that these are general messages. Uh, take what resonates and leave the rest behind. If this message didn't resonate with you, take a look at your other placements. Um, keep in mind that these are collective messages for the collective uh, Capricorn people not tapping into one specific person's energies in particular if you're looking for a reading tailored to your specific unique situations and your energies I suggest you to book a personal reading with me the link for that is in the description box below like share comment subscribe hit the notification bell so that you, uh, you guys get notified on when my new videos post and when I go live all right, so Capricorn, tell me about Capricorn in love. Tell me about Capricorn in love. Over energies for Capricorn regarding love and the person that they are connecting with for the first half of their March from the 1st to 15th, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Capricorn. All right, we have the Fool card here and the Ace of Wands. So there's a passionate new beginning that's happening here, okay? Um, so the full Aries energy could also be Aquarius energy. Could be dealing with any of those energies. You might have those energies in your chart. We have the King of Pentacles here and the Two of Wands. Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo could be dealing with another Earth sign here. Okay. We have the Lovers, Gemini energy and the Ten of Pentacles. Wow. I mean, this situation that you're in with this individual here, Capricorn, is going to turn out really, really, really great. I feel like with the Four of Wands here and the Death card, I feel like it could be a very transformative connection here, a transformative relationship. The thing is with the King of Pentacles here, someone here is deciding on this or deciding or that there is an option here that someone here has to make a choice between two people or you or something else here. Tell me about the King of Pentacles. We have the Six of Pentacles. Tell me about the Two of Wands here and the world. One of the things I'm getting here is that if you guys have been in kind of like this dating phase, I do feel like with the world here, I feel like you guys are about to take things to the next level here where there's going to be marriage, there's going to be commitment here, okay? Perhaps if you guys haven't moved in together, you guys might move in together. Uh, it could be a long distance situation where you guys are going to, you know, move closer together, okay? Tell me about the lovers. We have the chariot. Cancer energy. Tell me about the ten of pentacles. And the knight of pentacles. Wow. Knight of pentacles and the ace of pentacles. It just seems like a situation where you guys are about to take things to the next level here. Yeah, whoever this is, I do feel like this person's really serious about moving things along here. Tell me about the person that Capricorn is dealing with here. What is this person's true feelings and intentions towards Capricorn for the first half of their march from the 1st to 15th? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs for Capricorn. Nine of Wands and the Eight of Wands. The Tower and the Hangman. Nine of Swords and the Five of Wands here. Okay, Six of Wands and the Eight of Wands. I mean, yes, no, Nine of Wands and the Eight of Wands. I wonder what's going on with this individual. The Tower and the Hangman. So Tower, Aries, Scorpio energy, the Hangman, Piscean energy. The Nine of Swords here and the Five of Wands. Hmm. You know, for, 
Regarding your person here, I feel like this person's deciding whether to walk away from the situation with you or not because I feel like a lot of people are getting involved here. Like I feel like a lot of people are talking into your person's ear here and I feel like this person can't make the decision themselves. With the Queen of Cups and the Eight of Cups here. Seems like this person wants to walk away from the situation to save you the heartache of, you know, this turning into something really bad. Yeah, for some reason, I feel like this person can't take things to the next level here with you because I feel like, you know, this person is listening to other people here. Uh, tell me about the tower. We have the Queen of Pentacles. We have the King to the Queen of Pentacles here, the Hangman and the Emperor. Aries energy. You know what? I do feel like this king might or this masculine does have a decision between two people here. A, de a decision between an ex and a new person, which I feel like it's it might be you, Capricorn. It does seem like someone here is getting in the way here. Maybe it's this Queen of Cups. Because someone here met a soulmate, okay? And I feel like it's this Emperor uh, or this King uh, with this Queen of Cup Pentacles. And I feel like this Queen of Cups is someone else. Aries energy with the Emperor, Queen of Pentacles, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Justice, Libra energy. Tell me about the person or tell me about the outcome and advice here for... Uh, Capricorn regarding their love situation. What does Capricorn need to know, look out for, work on for the first half of their March from the 1st to the 15th? Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus signs. Page of Swords and Ace of Pentacles. High Priestess and the Knight of Wands. Queen of Wands and the King of Cups. We got the King to the Queen of Cups. So this Queen of Wands is an outside person. Okay, Page of Swords and Ace of Pentacles. So there is a passionate new beginning here, but I do feel like an ex is getting in the way. Like, I feel like an ex is stopping this from happening. I, you know, this, I feel like an ex is in this energy a bit of a, like, like kind of like a damsel in the sky sort of thing. It's sort of like, you know, this person might be coming back to your person to say, oh my God, like, I don't know, maybe this person's going to make up a story and say, oh my God, I got into like a car accident and I broke my leg or something like that. Something along those lines where, you know, I feel like this, this individual is trying to get your person to go rescue them. And it's kind of like a doorway for them to like get their ex back. Does that make sense? We have the Knight of Wands here and the High Priestess, Cancer Pisces. Interestingly enough, I feel like your person's not going to fall for it because I feel like your person is not even paying attention to this Queen of Wands here. This is that outside person, okay? This is the X. Yeah, this is the X. Tell me about the uh, Page of Swords, Libra, Aquarius, Gemini, Page of uh, Knight of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag, Page, uh, the High Priestess, Cancer, Pisces, Queen of Wands, Aries, Leo, Sag, King of Cups, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces. We have the Eight of Pentacles. Ace of Pentacles here in the Four of Pentacles. I do feel like the obstacle that's coming in the way, such as an, this X here, I, I, I do feel like it's 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 not even going to be a problem. I feel like your person's not even going to, you know, blink an eye if this person does try to pull something here. Uh, the uh, Knight of Wands and the Higher Fent Taurus energy, the High Priestess. You and this person have a very spiritual connection here. We have the Emperor to the Empress, King of Pentacles to the Queen of Pentacles, King of Cups to the Queen of Cups. But this is going to turn out to be something really, really, really great, Capricorn. Yeah, but like I said, the only thing is that, you know, once this X gets uh, catches wind of this, they're going to try and stop it. The Hierophant Taurus energy, the Empress Libra Taurus, we have the Three of Wands here, the King of Cups and the Seven of Pentacles, yeah. You're, I mean, this masculine is not even paying attention to this Queen of Wands here at all. Yeah, this Queen of Wands is going to be waiting around forever. Yeah, 
your 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 masculine does not want anything to do with this queen of wands okay so uh capricorn i hope that this was helpful i hope that this resonated if it did leave a comment down in the comment section below share this video like this video if you haven't done so yet subscribe hit the notification bell i'll speak to you guys in the next one all right thanks guys bye